I think a lot of people avoid investing for the wrong reasons. And often it's because they're they're fearful. They're, it looks complicated. It looks safe. What if I get it wrong? So there's a real, for many people, a huge emotional burden to getting invested. And I would say for most people, the biggest behavioral cost, most reliably reliable behavioral cost to investing is actually not what they do when they invest. You know, we can solve some of that with the investing rules and investing constitution. But the biggest cost for most people is they leave too much of their available savings doing nothing in a bank account year after year after year. And that is enormously costly because even if I take that person and I put them in a completely tediously boring, moderate risk, passive ETF, asset allocation that's buy and sell, no engagement whatsoever, over time, that moderate risk portfolio should be expected to earn above what you would get in a bank account roughly in the region of 4 to 5% per year. If I'm leaving 4 to 5% per year on the sidelines because I'm emotionally uncomfortable, it's a phenomenally expensive way of getting to sleep better at night. Yeah.